to episode two of how to videos i messed that up completely but um yeah so if you remember this monstrosity from the last episode um in how to's then i'm sure you will know what this is about if you've watched it if you haven't then i can't be bothered to explain again so just go and watch it and you'll find out so um today i'm going to be showing you how to make a mini concrete duck either in survival or creative so both will all right so um yeah let me get myself back into first person and let's just go into it so the one in creative is fairly simple um all you need is well you you know i like ducks so like if you've watched all of my videos you'll i'm sure you'll find out if you what if you pay attention then um yeah, so all you need is a one bit of yellow concrete and two different types of buttons. So you're going to need a acacia wood button and a dark oak wood button um, for this duckling. So you just need one piece of yellow concrete. You put the acacia button there and then the dark oak one there and the dark oak one there. So these are the eyes and that's the beak. And I thought it was pretty awesome especially to cover up any stray redstone like if you need three buttons for anything like a minecart elevator or whatever if you're more advanced in redstone <laughs> than i am definitely probably most of you but um and yes yeah, so that's the duckling in survival but uh, i mean creative i am so, i'm getting my words mixed up today um so we're in survival if you've seen um any other videos if that i haven't uploaded yet because i've recorded them yesterday and stuff so i haven't uploaded it yet so uh yeah i, I uploaded this one first um so what are you gonna go uh, you make concrete in survival mode by making gravel and sand to make concrete powder and um then you add dye to it so if you if you want to make concrete from the concrete powder all you need to do is place the concrete powder in the water and then you can see it's turned you can see it sort of flickers see that it's quite fast but it's literally like sand but it turns into this awesomeness when it's done um so yeah i'm gonna have that on my how-to videos for the rest of my life now but um hey it's all it's a, it's a start it's a start so once you've got your um your concrete you can just gather it up with a stone pickaxe i think it is i don't know if you can collect it with wooden uh let me check hang on let me get a wooden pickaxe and then you shall all learn something today so i'll go into survival Ooh, there we go so if you use a wooden pickaxe does it break Oh, it does. Okay, so you can just use a wooden pickaxe. I don't know if you can use your hand or not. I don't think you can. But let's find out. Uh, it's all about testing in these videos. Oh. Oh, that's just annoying. That's just annoying. I hate it when that happens. When someone walks in front of you when you're trying to break obsidian or something with a diamond pickaxe. But, uh, no. So use a wooden pickaxe at least um, to do that. So I'm going to go back into creative and yeah so that's pretty much it i mean it, it's quite useful to hide redstone but also it's cute so you can just and also you can build like a body and stuff like doing legs and like i don't know i can't be bothered to get concrete out again so yeah just take the, that as a tutorial of how to make it's got a hat um, how to make things like that and um yeah i hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching and uh, yeah, bye.